morning, guys. Just dropped Nazoni off. Um, she gave her flowers and her chocolate and her homemade birthday card to Miss Valens. I don't buy the birthday cards anymore. That's like you're saving yourself like six dollars, seven dollars. And plus, it's more special when they've drawn it themselves. Coda had a little bit of a draw in it too because she felt that left out. So she drew like a potato person. It was so cute. Um, and yeah, Ms. Balance has got so much flowers. She's got about, I think, three bunches in there. So she's got one, two, three. One from me, Kerry, and another mum. <coughs> and they're all the same type of flower too, which is pretty cute. But they're like different colours. They're all different colours. So, can you? So we're just off to, I'm just going to head off to the shops. I need to really desperately get a pedicure. My toes are like yellow. Like, you know when you've had polish on them for so long? Because I've always got polish on my toes. They discolour your toes, like yellow. Even though they put like a coat down, like a base base coat first, it's this mine toes still go yellow. It's gross, and you can see it without nail polish on. And I had to take my nail polish off because I had a blue. I think I had a blue color, and they were like chipped to the days, and I just it just looked feral looking, and I just didn't like it. So I took it off, and then my toes were like feral. I'm like, oh my god, I just need them done because I hate looking at them in there at all. So that's where I'm going to head and Coda's going to watch. It'll only be quick. Hi Kurikia, you're being very patient, waiting for mummy for her toes to dry. Thank you for being patient. Come, sit here. You can sit here. Mummy's toes are just drying. Pretty pink. <laughs> <laughs> right, me and Coda in the building. Oh, yo, I seriously need to, like, look. Look! That would have been my mum, because it's coffee. And she would have dripped coffee everywhere. Mm-hmm. That's my mum. Look at my pretty toes. My toes are pretty again. Yay! Yay. I was sitting underneath the fan. But honestly, like, I was probably sitting there, like, half an hour. And I'm like, okay, can I go now? Didn't ask that. I just felt my toes. I'm like, yeah, they're dry. And then I just walked out. And I paid for it and walked out. I'm like, man. My toes are freezing because there's like a constant fan and they were just in the water and it was like I could not feel my toes I was so numb I'm like oh my god my toes are gonna fall off me and Coda are sharing a kebab I do not know the last kebab I had I'm it, they were like babies the last one I had I got put off them because um the last kebab I had the 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 meat is really oily and you can feel the oil like on the roof of your mouth and I just hated it. Me and Shannon haven't had a kebab in ages. Well, I don't know about him, but I haven't. So today I got one. I don't know why, but I felt like one. And um, they can't be all that bad. You know, it's a wrap. It's got lettuce, tomato, onion. Maybe the meat is a bit fatty because I used to work. My first job was a kebab. It was a kebab <laughs> joint, so. Oh. Very cool. Yeah. So me and Kara are gonna share. I got mixed. I got <laughs> lamb and beef, which is my favorite combo. And then I get sour cream and barbecue sauce, which is my favorite combination sauce, like together. And then I'm gonna clean up after this because this home seriously needs a vacuum and a mop, like a desperate mop. But yeah, me and Kara are up to nothing today. Just chilling. Chill on like villains. I freaking lost you guys. You were underneath my hat. Couldn't find you for ages. <laughs> okay, so I vacuumed and mopped. Both the girls have been, oh, both the girls. Nazoni's been picked up from school. Um, and then I shot off to Aldi because I had these contour pillows for 30 bucks. And latex 
contour pillows are actually really expensive to buy. So I decided to get the LD one. These are the only ones that they had in store. This one, the latex contour pillow and this other, I don't know, feather one. I didn't want the feather one. It was actually quite big and I was just like, nah, I need something that will support. So this is what it looks like. It's got this contour bit in the bottom. The sides come up a bit, like a tiny bit. Um, and it comes with this, this pillow, like pillowcase. And even that's quite, um, like cushiony itself but I'm just trying it out now I want to see what it feels like to actually lay on it man because I woke up terrible this morning holy shit oh my god oh man that bit for that for my shoulder is so good because I lay on my shoulder my shoulder comes forward like this and I lay on it and the flat of the pillow like the flat of the pillow, the more I'm leaning on my shoulder and then when I wake up, my shoulder's sore from being in the same position all night. Have any of you had that? That means you don't have a supportive, well, um, you don't have a supportive pillow. So that's why your shoulder's hurting. Because me and Carrie said I sleep the same way she does. Because I get sore shoulders, she said she does. And it's that. You need the right distance like so you're not so like leaning all your weight on your shoulder kind of thing it's kind of like just a nice lot nice like oh. uh, I like how the side comes up because usually I put my head to this edge of the pillow because I like how my face kind of just falls off oh, I'm ready for bed now guys good night Oh, latex, you are good, girl. Oh. Oh. Usually I'm not a back sleeper, but I could totally sleep on my back with this pillow. Oh, yeah, this is nice. <coughs> <coughs> It'll be even better with this pillowcase on it, too, I reckon. This one. Mmm. I've been having really shit sleeps, plus the workouts that I've been doing, when I've, that I've been trialling out at this place have been so, their programs are like HIT. So their workouts are HIT workouts, which means high intensity interval training. Sweet, I might give these Bambillo, this Bambillo one to my mum, because that Bambillo I got off, the, those ads that you see, oh. We got them off scoop on. They're shit. They're actually not really good at all. But I think this is going to be a lifesaver. Was going to get a Lorraine Lee, but still with 30% off, it was still going to cost 40 something. And these were only 35. So I was like, can't miss that deal. That's pretty good. So now I'm going to try, try it with the pillowcase on it. It says to wash the pillowcase, but nah, whatever. I'll just put it on. Oh, I smell some shit. Oh, it is. It's manure. Move, Lilo. Just going to close up everything now because it's starting to get a bit chilly. Oh, that close. Oh. She's gonna break that trampoline. She keeps climb, climbing up the net of it. So bad. I think I need to get myself a head band because I get extremely hot in these sessions that I end up ditching my hat. <laughs> because I just, I just feel the pressure on my head. Like I don't even wanna wear it tonight, but my forehead's looking kind of big. So I feel like I need to wear it. Again, left my fucking camera at home. All right, just quickly cooking up me and the girls some pasta. 
I'm just gonna bring this to the boil. It's a little boil. Carbs is where it's at, girl. Need carbs after that workout, but that was a mean session. We did battle ropes, but not your usual battle ropes. It was sides, so you're like bringing your arms out to the side, and holy shit, it kills. It kills for a whole, Mom, how long? Mom, it doesn't 20 seconds, 30 seconds. We did 30 tonight, 30 seconds on, 30, 10 second transition. No, 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 no. All right, sit up and eat. You need to go to bed. Alrighty, guys. I'm all showered up, feeling so much better. Girls are both in bed. They fell asleep pretty much straight away after dinner, so they were really good tonight. I'm going to call it a night now. I've just finished editing today's vlog, so yeah. Can't wait to try out my latex pillow. I'm like a bit over-obsessed. I was like editing today's vlog and I'm like, okay. I'm going on a bit about this bloody pillow. Sorry about it. Um, yeah, I don't think I need to say anything. This is usually when I used to get to say what I need to say, but I don't need to say anything. Tonight's workout was amazing. I already said that. Maybe I should just say goodnight. <laughs> don't forget to like this vlog, guys, if you haven't already. Subscribe if you're not subscribed, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night.